We're very happy to be moving in uh, to the new downtown station, uh, which is going to be the headquarters for the downtown team here at 960 Olive Street. Uh, this is really the culmination of a commitment that the chief uh, made to the community, to city council, uh, a couple of years ago when the idea of the police department leaving City Hall and moving across the river to the Country Club location first became apparent. Um, so what we have here is the ability for our nine dedicated downtown bicycle officers, uh, the sergeant Larry Crompton and our community service officer Tony Weber to actually be downtown in the area that they're responsible for keeping safe and working with the partners to make it uh, a better and more livable place for people to come work and play. There's a lot of really good advantages to being in this particular location. It really has helped facilitate the partnership with LCC Security. It gives us that presence right sort of in the heart of everything. The downtown library is across the street. The main LTD uh, transfer station is across the street. And here we are at the new academic center for, for LCC, which also has a residence hall coming to it. And with all the exciting things that are going on here in downtown Eugene, new businesses, uh, a new uh, student apartments that are going to be going up. Um, this is really sort of the hub and we're happy to be a part of it. Well the main uh, advantage for the community is uh, it allows us to maintain a more constant and visible presence downtown. Uh, when we move from City Hall to our new headquarters uh, at 300 Country Club, uh, that created quite a distance for officers on bicycles to be able to travel back and forth. Uh, being downtown, centrally located, uh, officers have a place to write their reports uh, and take care of the daily necessities rather than ride across the bridge. So uh, the main purpose is to, uh, to assist them in being more productive um, and efficient and also continue and increase uh, services to the community. You know, the fear of crime sometimes is worse than crime itself and, and we want people to know that downtown Eugene is safe it's open for business, uh, it's, a, it's a safe place to live, to work, to recreate, to educate, and part of that, and only, only a part of it, but a big part of it is our police presence down here. The other thing that being down here really has helped us do is enhance our, our relationships with both the downtown businesses, um, again residents who live down here, and uh, not to be left out, our private public safety partners. There's a number of private security companies downtown, whether it be DePaul Security, you know, most people are familiar with the, the downtown guides, um, advanced security, and of course G4S which contracts with LTD. And so being downtown and getting to, uh, establishing those relationships and really enhancing those relationships uh, is an important factor again in making downtown a place that people want to be. It's solidity, um, we know we're going to be here. The community knows we're going to be here. They don't have to guess, well, you know, where are the police downtown? We have a, a really what's going to be a visible footprint down here. Um, and I think that's really going to enhance people's perception of, of the department and the safety of downtown. The station is going to be open to walk-in traffic Monday through Friday from 9 in the morning till noon and then from 1 in the afternoon till 4. I would caution people, um, there is limited parking down here uh, or you have to pay to park. So my recommendation has been and will continue to be, if you're already down here, if you work here or you live here or you happen to be downtown, um, by all means drop into the station. We're happy to see you and happy to help you. If you have to drive from a different location and you need police services, you probably are going to be better served going to HQ just because uh, there's more parking, ample parking, um, and there's there's more resources there available. So if two or three people dropped in here and, and needed to file a crime report, uh, you might have to wait a little longer here than perhaps you would at HQ just because there's fewer officers working. But by all means, we definitely want the community, uh, if you're downtown and you need police services, this is the first place to start.